Got a Weavile and maybe a uh, Libre. And there you see it, Weavile we coming are. right out. <laughs> now there, there's a few things that Weavile can do to get in on uh, Suicune, such as taunt cancels, agility, mm -hmm. just getting in there and being able to apply pressure. Right, right. So I do, as we're getting underway here, we're going to see maybe some, some Pokemon coming out here. Nice job with that Waterfall getting right in, getting some solid damage off at the start. Yep, and uh, there's, there's Hoshi setting up the... Uh, just jumping back. Oh. You know, he's applying a lot of pressure here. There's there's not a whole lot that Weavile can really do in dual phase, I feel like, to get right in right away without having some sort of problem. Misbehave taking a lot of damage right now. Hoshi on the offensive does whip that punch there. And that move is actually punishable. But she didn't quite get that punish off, and that's what makes a big difference. If you can capitalize on the faults of your opponent. Yep, and Weavile already has burst because Weavile is one of those very fast energy gainers. Because Weavile is Weavile. Weavile is Weavile. <laughs> we are seeing the burst from Misty. Hey. Not going to pop the Jirachi buff, though. I don't Managing know. to anti air with it. Oh, and here we go. straight into burst. Now, Weavile's burst is unique as it does take away the opponent's synergy gauge. Which is really nice here, but you can also see that Princess Hoshi does have the Jirachi buff on standby in case he needs to use that, which he may very well do so, but he is pressured a lot right now by Misbehave. All right, almost got it. Just needs to win this phase. There we go. And now he has it ready on standby for the next fit, for the next fight. So definitely really nice job from Hoshi, really saving, at least getting the Jirachi buff while he has a chance, regardless of whether or not he did win that round. Because now... He can start off with burst, and in any time he feels the pressure, he can use it. Absolutely. <clears throat> now, both these players do have burst on standby for each other. Beautiful grab against that counter on this behave. Nice chunk of damage, too. Not a whole lot, but you know what? Hey, something's better than nothing, that's for sure. All right, it looks like uh, Misbehave does have Burst and Jirachi to use at any time right now. Oh, she's still not having his Jirachi buff for himself here. This is going to be a big difference in whether or not the power can come out from Misbehave. Jirachi just... buff? Oh. oh. Super close, though. In Rage, now he's, he's going to pop that Burst. And the burst is still going to be amplified here, and this is going to be a lot of damage that can come out. Took away burst just at the right moment. Oh, Hoshi has it back. But can he get it stolen from himself? Big damage against the wall. Oh, no. Does with that. Oh, nice Taking touch. away once more. We are at one HP. Oh, no. She might Press actually get it. Oh. <laughs> beautiful Four job from his behavior. Exactly. That was beautiful gameplay coming out from Misbehave. She's not. She's saying, I'm not giving up just yet. You can't take me down. And that's the thing about these players is that you can never count them out. Even if they're at the lowest of HP, you can really see that the comeback mechanic is there. As long as you're outplaying your opponent, you'll find that there's a lot of things that you can do to make a comeback. So don't ever give up on yourself. That's what's important as well. I'm an inspirational quote just waiting to happen. <laughs> you need to write a book. Yeah, I should. All right, so a lot of damage already onto Misbehave. She's taken about half here, but beautiful job snuffing that counter out. Just keeping keeping Burst away from Hoshi as well, making sure that uh, he, he can't use it as a comeback factor. Shadow Claw keeping him against the wall. A lot of wall pressure here. Big damage. Not quite as much as you'd like, but hey. <laughs> All right, buff up. Hoshi definitely on the offensive here. Gets him against the oh. wall. Gonna activate Burst as well. Oh, oh no! <laughs> that Jirachi buff, was that a crit as well? I, I didn't, oh yes, it was a crit. So Burst may save Misbehave. <laughs> oh my goodness, that is almost down, but. 45 HP left on Misbehave, the Fury Swipes comes out! Misbehave takes game number one in this best of three. But it looks like uh, Misbehave has been practicing their combos, knows what they're doing. The moment they get in, uh, Hoshi's in danger. Hoshi definitely has to focus on keeping Misbehave out. Oh, absolutely. And we're not going to see a character swap here. I don't know if I agree with this or not, but I am seeing that, you know, hey, Misbehave did a fantastic job keeping the pressure on Princess Hoshi that whole time, never really letting him get away with anything. And that was what was super crucial in that match. All right, Hoshi getting a nice first hit here. Getting a little bit of synergy build up for himself. Not too shabby. And Misbehave having a really, really hard time finding her way in right now. 
just, just, just so like I said, as long as Hoshi can keep misbehave out, um, Hoshi, Hoshi has stands a very good chance at this. Tries to go for the grab, it's not going to work out in her favor. Princess Hoshi taking round number one in game two. Nice. It was like he didn't really take a whole lot of damage. What he did was he spaced out, misbehaved really, really well there, and just kept her at a distance. And I think that that's super crucial. Dive kick snuffing out the counter. Oh, nice job. Racks up a little bit of damage. Very nice taunt. And what's great about this is now Princess Hoshi has the, def uh, the debuff on himself. And, you know, this can make a big impact if he's getting ready to burst, for sure. Now, this, this is looking like a really dominant game for Princess Hoshi. You know, he took a really hard hit before on that first game, and now he's coming back. You know, he's saying, I'm not going to be out of this. And I definitely, wow, <laughs> super fast super game fast two. Game two. Tying it up really quickly as well. I mean, there was a really big shift change between the playstyle of Princess Hoshi from game number one versus game number two. And I feel like that might have gotten in Miss Behave's head a little bit because, you know, she was on the offensive. She was doing the damage. She was getting him in the wall and pressuring. And now Hoshi changes it up. Hoshi stands back, waits for Miss Behave to approach, and we have a Libre on the screen. Mucho fuerte en su vida. <laughs> It is a uh, pity that I cheated in Spanish class, so I cannot join you. <laughs> it, it's un oh, problema. It looks like I have a round, so joining on commentary will be Utah. Not the entire state, but just the player. <laughs> what? I want I, I want the whole state commentating with me. Okay, there's no way I'm done. I'm, I'm quitting. No. <laughs> Alright, so how can the game finish? So right now, the score is 1-1, Misbehave versus Princess Hoshi. Game number three, this is the final game here. And we can already see Princess Hoshi doing massive amounts of damage to Misbehave. She's not gotten a single hit yet. He's, he's, he's doing really well, keeping her out, keeping her distance. Um, she, she switched to the Libre. Interesting, interesting call. That was weird. Like, Suicune went underneath Libre, yes. <laughs> like, soaped himself up and just went right I under. Mean, when Suicune counters, he kind of has like a weird, like... Slip and slide mechanic? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> His hurt box, like, shrinks down, like, super tiny. And, like, locks it. That was a beautiful web. Mucho <laughs> electricidad. Oh, and got the, uh, the locker. That's uh, very nice. Nice job. Does get the speed debuff. This is actually a lot of damage onto Hoshi so far. Almost half health, in fact. Uh, I don't like that web at all, though. I mean, this is what Hoshi was doing last game. You know, he was keeping Misbehave out with a lot of projectile play, a lot of zoning, and not giving her the opportunity to find her way in. Well, she has a way in right now, though. It's a super easy match right now. Good homie back there from Hoshi. Now, she is in rage right now, and so this can be a really big play for Misbehave. She is going to pop that burst. It's going to help her out, but it has taken her out of rage. Oh, beautiful confirm off that, that, that cross up dive kick. And did get a lot of damage off the wall there. That was beautiful. <laughs> that was the sickest thing I've seen her do. <laughs> that was amazing. <laughs> Mucho fuerte en su vida. KO. She went for discharge, <laughs> canceled it into the immediate burst, uh, and he countered it, thinking she's going to follow up with the attack. And he's going to you know, counter and punish it. But she punished the contact by canceling it and into burst. That was so good. You really got to give it to Misbehave there. That was a beautiful job with that burst. Going to put her in the lead right now. Actually, no, it's tied up. Yep. So that's actually, this is the <laughs> final round. It's yep. been close every single game here. Yeah, I'm, I'm, very, I'm very proud of Misbehave. This is, again, uh, like, like she was saying, this is her first tournament ever. And here she is taking one of our uh, one of our, our, our veteran players to the, to, like, the brink of the of, of, uh, losing bracket. So. Right, and that does make a really big difference here, you know, in the skill level between the two players. But we're seeing a massive combo coming off from Princess Hoshi on to Misbehave. She is That's super cool. close to having Burst online. Oh, Sylveon? The defense buff and the Sylveon is still not going to do it. Brad, that shouldn't be it yet. Oh my gosh. Still no Burst though. <laughs> no! <laughs> All that web. Beautiful job from Princess Hoshi. Yeah. Doing a lot of great job weaving in and out there with the attacks, really keeping Misbehave on her toes. And that's yeah. what's going to close that but, but final game out. Misbehave there, uh, 